fucking kidding, bitch. Shut up. Hey, ya uh, Twitch? Is this, uh, a Monday with Murdoch podcast coming to Twitch? What? Sitting here with my Michelo, you know, like normal. Quick announcements real fast. Mondays with Murdoch will be recorded for YouTube, but live on Twitch. Might as well just send it out there. I am not going to edit the damn video, so it's going to be live on Twitch, but uploaded to YouTube. <clears throat> live on Twitch, uploaded to YouTube. No edit. Straight up, what you get is what you're going to get. That's it. I am joined today with my buddy Ethan. We're actually, he's not really part of the podcast, but I have a few questions for him. Anyway, I will get started with my business, Colossal. I'm going to go ahead and start with Colossal Business, so let's get started with that shit. Today, in the chat, let's see if I can actually move it here. In the chat, you see Mr. Welcome. I don't know his YouTube or anything yet, so just give him a welcome. And Mr. Absent Karma is also signed. They both signed the contracts today. Afro for Apex. Karma for Call of Duty. I'm going to get their information, probably do a, a profile just like I did for, you know, the rest of our team. Welcome to the family. Hope it all works out. I don't need any hatred in this damn party chat either. Um, let's move that back over. Maybe. Computer lagging like a bitch. Um, holy fuck. Uh, there we go. So, give them a, a good welcome. I have good hopes for our Call of Duty team. <clears throat> In other news, I also have a team goal for us. Everyone got to watch the Crazy Cowboy on Twitch. We're trying to get him affiliates. Please go watch him. That's our goal for August. Trying to get as many people affiliated as we can. Juniper will be next. She's very close. We'll go on the rest. Our yearly goal, which I believe people have agreed to, it is getting me partners so I can start a team page. I don't know. I don't think it's going to happen in a year, but we'll see. We'll find out. Just keep the good love coming. That's all I need. I just need love and views, man. Followers and everything. If all my followers were on, honestly watch, guess what? I'd be fucking partner already. Um, so, keep the love coming. Call of Duty news. Uh, well, I need, from what I feel like, one more player. Um, Uzi Smoothie, if you watch this podcast, buddy, you need to get on. Um, I know you have a busy schedule. I'm going to go ahead and recruit one more player. I'm going to put you on the bench. I have to. It's just that simple. I need I need serious players. I need someone who's going to be on like right now so we can run some practices, run some, run some team drills, run some shit. You know, that's what we need to do. Um, it's just that simple. I need that stuff. I need it so we can rebuild our Call of Duty team. Um, I believe it's it's more of my decision. Um, so I, I hope there's no hard feelings. I want you to be a content creator, if anything. I love it, Uzi. But man, we need some practicing. So I, I need to recruit somebody so we can get these practices. We need to just play together, man. That's it. Um, so if you can find time, great. 
If not, I gotta have somebody else. Um, that's Call of Duty news. Ethan. I don't know if he's still what? here. I have a question for you. Yes, I do like Dick. <laughs> yes, I do like Dick. Um, how are you? How are you honestly feeling about the COD team this year? For the four players that we have, we have Karma, Paradox, I, Ethan, and myself. I am feeling pretty damn good. You heard it from one of the soon-to-be captains himself, because if I can recruit two more people, I'm done. If I can recruit two more people, I'm done. Um, I don't. I do want to be part of the COD team, but I also don't want to be part of the COD team, if that makes any sense. Um, I love the COD team. But I feel for the best of the best, I should not be in there. I, I know there's people out there who's better than me. That's it. Um, my heart's in it, but it ain't in it. I am guess I'm to that age, maybe. I don't know. i rather just run the practices, schedule the practices, get the team ready. I'm a damn good motivator, so I can motivate the team. That's all I want to be. Hate to say it. Hate to say it. But I'm just. I don't know. Which, you know, Black Ops 4 wasn't my game, so maybe Modern Warfare might be, but we'll see when the time comes. Maybe I can come out of retirement. <laughs> Uh, other than that, um, I do have high hopes for our COD team. I mean, I don't think we're going to be in the Pro League right away, but, you know, we work at it. The players stay, they stay. If not, you know, I'm always looking. doesn't matter. I think these guys are all right. I think they'll stay. If they do, great. If they don't, well, all I have to say is there's a million others. Hate to say it. I'm a leader of a team. I'm an owner of a team, so if I lose one player, I'm going to recruit another one. It's kind of like an assembly line. Oh, I don't mention assembly lines. <laughs> it's just the cold hard truth, though. I mean, it's just like like your your job, your, your 9 to 5 job, you know? You wake up, you go to work, you I get wish fired. I wish it was 9 to 5. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> but, you know, you get fired. The company's already, if they're already firing you, they're already looking for another guy. It's that simple. Oh, yeah. And that's the way it is in the gaming league. If you leave, there's already someone else that wants to be in. We're a young team. We're going to grow. I believe in us. This is more just a, a colossal podcast is what I'll call it. Um, now, on other news... <coughs> I'm done with COD, for once. I know I've been stuck on it. On other news, we are looking for one Apex player. If you have the skill, go ahead and contact me. This will be up on YouTube. This will be on Twitch. I'm live on Twitch, uploading to YouTube. So if you're not following, go follow. Now... <coughs> As that is said, Wade, as of right now, he is the captain. Aphrodisiac, he is one of the players. Uh, I'll be 30 pick players. Uh, uh. You're, you're too busy for that, Juniper. You are a Minecraft pro. Oh, yeah, MLG Minecraft, motherfuckers. MLG Minecraft. Um, but the real business I want to get into, I have a game that I actually might be able to excel in. This might become as a shock to you guys. Kitty Squad. Kitten Squad. Oh, MLG. Oh, <laughs> okay, but for real. Uh, 
I might try to start doing some Rainbow Six. Oof. Yeah, you have fun with that. Um, I'm definitely different. I'm more tactical, so I think that's definitely my gameplay. But one reason why I'm thinking of uh, Rainbow Six is because some of it is going to start to be PS4. And I have a player that is actually really good if I can get him to play. His name is Swag Dog. Adam Swagger, I'm calling you out right now. If you come and you chat with me, we are going to make a Rainbow Six team. I will find us practice and I will find us wager matches if that's what it's going to take. But Rainbow Six is in the making. Stay tuned. It might be a real thing here coming up. But I have to talk to him because I want him to be the captain. I want him to be the leader. I don't want to be the leader of it. Of course, with him not playing so much, we might talk that out. I might have to be the coach or leader. Whatever. Um, but he can definitely excel in that. I'll even do 2v2 wager matches. I don't give a fuck. Me and Adam together, back from Call of Duty, our call-outs were on point. We are a fucking... We're a team that you don't want to go against if it's just me and him. However, he might be a little rusty. We'll find out. Probably. Um, but, again, playing a video game is kind of like riding a bike. Once you learn it, you're golden. Say so you might pick up the controller and fucking just blow your fucking heads off. You never know. We'll find out. Blow your load. Blow your blow load your off. Load. <laughs> so, I'm going to get with him and see what's up. Um, I don't know how that's going to go. I'm hoping he, uh, he'll say yeah, all. but we'll find out. Um, Overwatch. Uh, Oh, I'm sorry, Overwatch League. But I don't know anything about Overwatch. Again? Man! If you are an Overwatch player and you see this video, comment. Contact me. Let me know. I want competitive teams. I don't care if it's League of Legends. Uh, no. I don't, I don't, if... I don't care what it is. You get, you help Colossal out, and I promise you, you're gonna get the payout. I just, I'm just that simple. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what I can. My players is gonna do what they can. We're gonna help you out. We're gonna do what anyone would do. We're gonna go pro in something. We're gonna expand. We get one pro team. Everyone in the fucking colossal business is now famous, so come on. Let's get this shit started. It's time to go big or go home. I'd rather go big and go home, so come on. Bring your love. If you guys don't understand that reference, go big or go home, and I just said I want to go big and go home, meaning I want to work right here for you guys, bring you guys some competitive gameplay, and some content. Oh my god. So I can Every do it right here. Every this game is sniping today. I can get <clears throat> at least, you know, one team to go pro or one team to go at least amateur and get some money, we're going to do a, a lot better than what 
most people probably think. I think we can go big. It's just that simple. I feel like <clears throat> most of us can really excel in the content. I think most of us can really excel in the competitive league. Competitive for me, I don't know. I don't know yet. I, I, ain't, I ain't feeling it. I'm feeling like if I can help the team out, I can. But if I'm, if I'm falling behind, I'm just... I'll give up my spot in a heartbeat. And I know this, I said no more Call of Duty business, but let me just bring this up. If I do step down as Call of Duty captain, it will be going over to Ethan. Just because he's a close friend and I can trust him with it. A captain role isn't to be taken lightly. I can explain that some other time. Um, I think Wade would be a good captain for Apex just because he is very persistent. Um, his heart's in this. And that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for someone who's full out wanting to get shit done. Because if you don't, if you don't keep up with it, you ain't gonna go anywhere in it. <clears throat> um, I, I work constantly, so to come home and stream, you know, sometimes it's kind of difficult, but I still do it. I'm still keeping up with my Mondays with Murdoch. I think last week I took off, and the week before that I took off, but. It's still, I'm still here, still doing shit, still streaming every day, so I'm keeping up with what I have to do, I'm keeping up with the team, signing people, looking for people, shit. I might be signing another one sometime. So, I don't know. I don't really have much else to say about all that. That's colossal business for you. Mondays with Murdoch. That's your colossal business. Everyone wants to know what's going on inside colossal. Well, there you go. There you have it. <clears throat> I you know. Um, we still have some content creators that really aren't doing a lot, but they are being supportive. That's all we're looking for. It's being supportive. Um. As you know, if anyone has been keeping track, Caleb, my dear friend, Beyond Illusion, I don't think he's part of Colossal anymore. I don't really think it's us kicking him out. It's just him not being here. And if you watch this, Beyond Illusion, just know I'm still here for you, but what you did to me is kind of fucked up, you know? I help you out in more ways than one, and you just kind of leave me in the dirt. I bought you a controller, I shipped it to you, I thought you were going to be one of my best Call of Duty players ever, turns out you're the worst. You know, leaving someone in the dust like that, that's probably the worst thing you can ever do to somebody. Acting as a friend to somebody, that's the worst thing you can do to somebody. That person thought that you were going to do something with this team, that you were going to provide for this team. So he, he provided for you, and then you just dis disappear without a fucking word. You don't say bye, kiss my ass, or anything. You just left. Well, that's a little cold. I call people out. I hate to say it. 
you know, people want to call me out all the time, that's fine. I'm giving them a subject to talk about. But at least they got something to talk about. And I don't have anything negative that people can talk about. So I don't give a fuck. What I'm calling you out on is something that's negative that nobody should ever have done to anybody. So if you watch this video, you can hit, go ahead and hit that thumbs down. I don't give a fuck. Give me a million dislikes. I don't really care. But I'm calling you out because it's just it ain't it ain't right. You know, I, I bought you a controller. I, I helped you excel. I, I, I put you in situations you're not used to. You became a better player. I was afraid to one v one you and next thing I know you just disappear. That's just not cool. I thought you were part of Colossal, but you let everyone down. You didn't just leave me down, you let everybody down. One of the best players I've seen, and I don't know how long, he just let me down. I will give him some credit. Kid would probably whoop my fucking ass on any game mode, but a 1v1. It's just different tactics, that's it. I would probably outsmart him on Search and Destroy 1v1, that's fine. But if we're leaving our players in a 1v1 situation, hopefully they can clutch up. But I'd rather have it a, a 5v1. I'd rather have it a 4v1 or a 2v1 or a 3v1, not a 1v1. Someone screwed up somewhere. It's going to happen, though. I hate to say it. But, Ethan, I don't know. What would you say about Caleb? How good he was? I mean, I, I, <clears throat> it's, what it comes down to is he was good. And I he mean, just... gridlock control what's his shit we ran that we we locked down <clears throat> right side we we locked down that yeah and B I, side the whole other team all three players could go to the other side and, and this kid and ethan would just i wouldn't have to worry about b <laughs> we would <clears throat> melt the fuck out of them and, and and most of the time the three people going to a had a lockdown so it's not i mean we our gridlock control was on point I mean, that was about it, though. Gridlock control was about it. For control. Yeah. For, for control, it was about it. But his grab slam, I mean, dude was a, an absolute animal with it. Didn't you? Didn't he run grab slam, or did you? Yeah, he did. <clears throat> yeah, because you want, ran War Machine. I don't know. Caleb, I'm not throwing any shade your way. I'm just calling you out. However, I still love you. You always have a room in Colossal, but you're going to have to prove it now. I doubt it you're coming back, but if you happen to watch this video, thank you for the support. I'm still your buddy. You call me, you need something, I'll do my best to be there. That's all I can say. I don't hate on anyone. Actually, there's only one person I hate, but we ain't going there. <clears throat> now, as of these new guys that joined, I am super stoked for them to join. I hope they understand what Colossus is all about. These guys seem to be an alright asset to the team. Um, Karma brings a lot to the ta table. He's good. And he's young. So, hopefully he can... It's a good combo. Hopefully he can take the top notch. I don't give a fuck if he's above me every game. As long as we get that W. That's all I'm looking for. I don't give a fuck if I got 0 and 50. We get that W. That's all we need. Um, call out is going to be important. Um, gun control. You know, we got to make sure the guns is what... The guns should be. What attachments? <clears throat> Communication. That's why we gotta play together. Um, a team. A team takes building. I mean, it, it, it takes time to build. It is going to be time-consuming. It's gonna eat your fucking brain. But we get to that step. We got it. What is up, GG? Mondays with Murdoch is now on Twitch. going to be uploaded to YouTube. So glad you can join. Um, 
we're talking about Colossal and the competitive aspects to Colossal today. Uh, <clears throat> I feel like Paradox is going to be bringing a lot to the table for his side of the ball. They're both, him and Karma is both kind of an SMG player so far from what I've seen. Which is exactly what I want because I'd rather just fucking snipe and be in the back and lock down the points. If I can have two crazy maniacs that get kills in the hard point and get streaks, I'll gladly lock down spawn and be bored as fuck all day. I'm totally fine with that. Um, but that takes, you know, that takes practice. That's map control. Again, in Call of Duty, if you get map control, you win the game. Yeah, basically. You have map control, you're winning the game. The only thing we gotta work on is not breaking down mid game. We cannot fight, we cannot argue mid game. Competitive teams will butt heads. They're gonna have to understand that people are gonna butt heads. Don't do it mid game, do it after. I will set the practices up, I will do what I have to get these competitive teams on the front line. As for some of the competitive teams, so I just, like I said, I, well, I'm recruiting for anything. Uh, anything else in the competitive aspect I gotta talk about? I have content creators now that are starting to uh, come about, which is great. I love seeing that stuff as a as an owner. I love seeing people wanting to to stream. Um, Snaps. I'm gonna go ahead and call him out on YouTube. We had a bit of a whatever you want to call it, misjudgment, misagreement, bad call, whatever you want to call it. I don't give a fuck what you want to call it. Whatever. He's streaming on Twitch. Go check him out. Snaps1122, I believe it is. Uh, let's look. Hold on. Yeah, Snaps. S H N A P S one one two two. Go check him out. Um, he brings some pretty good content. Uh, I actually <coughs> get on his stream every time he streams. I'm um, show everybody love. In fact, sorry, Alex. I didn't know. I didn't know you were streaming. I need eleven more till fifty. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and. On my YouTube and Twitch, I'm going to go ahead and shout out Juniper. She needs 11 more people to get 50. Well, 11 more followers. 11 more followers to get 50. So go give her some love. Shout her out if you have to. Share her streams. Whatever you guys have to do. We are colossal. This is what we do. We want to go big. <clears throat> and I hope that Gigi can help us get there as well. I know she has a lot of friends, a lot of people. Um, we get... One of us to partner, we can start a team page. Hopefully she'll be part of Colossal for a long time. Um, she definitely deserves it, as well as everybody else that is participating in this. Ethan, Juniper, Crazy Cowboy, Schnapps, Mad Russian, the other owner. Um, we went 50-50. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go there. We went 50-50, that's what we did. Um, he actually wanted 49 and gave me 51, but I was like, dude, we started this together. I'm an even person. Call me even Steven if you would. I said 50-50. So, go give him some love on, I think, YouTube. I think he streams his YouTube more than he will Twitch. I'm not sure. Twitch kind of fucking over earlier. That's just the count up. This is something I want to do on the daily stream for you guys talk to you guys let you guys know what's going on with colossal i can't do that if i'm at work i'll try come winter i might be able to do a little bit more I'm not sure yet but our main aspect or mine my main aspect right now as an owner is i i have to get one of these
pro teams going. I I'll have to get out. yes. I have to lift one of these guys up. I don't you care. Gotta, you got to make it what like it is. your fucking PS4 when you're playing Call of Duty. Yes. Yeah, you know, it got to sound like that jet engine going. I need off. a jet engine to take off under their asses. So we're. I'm pushing. I am getting another player for Apex. I am getting another player for Call of Duty. If I wanna, if I can recruit League of Legends, I'll do it. If I have to recruit Rainbow Six, I'll do it. I need someone to take Colossal to the next step. Okay, I need players that will compete. I'm not looking for content no more. We have enough of that. I'm looking for competitors. If you have a competitive mindset, hit that comment section. Comment. Go ahead, leave me a message. I don't care. I'll even put my email in if I have to. I don't care. I need competitors. I'm not looking for content. No more. We have content creators. Gigi's a content creator. I'm a content creator. Crazy Cowboy's a content creator. Juniper. I keep wanting to say zombie. Juniper. Content creator. Shade. Content creator. Snaps. Content creator. The Goy Boy. We're both. What? I said Shade the content creator, alright. We are looking for competitors at this moment. So hit that comment section. Let me know what you got. I don't care about your stats. Before we go any further with that, I don't care how many kills you got in Apex. I don't care how many wins you got in Apex. I don't care, don't about, care about your any KD your stats. and fucking Black Ops. I want to know how you act as a teammate. I want to know. I want to get to know you. So you join, or if I if I feel like you're an all right player, I have you join. A YouTube and Twitch will help your stat, though. I will say that. That's it. Because I'm looking for players that will give out content as they compete. It's a hard thing to do, but I'm about to do it. So this is your Mondays with Murdoch. It will be on Twitch all day, every day. Only on Mondays. Uh, every day. <laughs> I like saying it. I don't know. It's just a weird, weird catchphrase. Mondays with Murdoch will now be on Twitch, live on Twitch, every day, or every Monday at 8. Will be uploaded to YouTube, though, so if you miss it on Twitch, you can go to my YouTube. Link is in the info, so check that out as well. Um, either scroll down or go to my profile on Twitch, scroll over, click, 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 YouTube, bam. Subscribe. Subscribe here as well. Follow me as well. Whatever you want to do, support the stream, guys. I love everyone that gives me support. Everybody is a great person. Just support it. And I will see you guys next Monday. And as for Twitch, I will see you again in about five minutes. I will be streaming some Call of Duty. So peace out. Love you guys. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And I'll be back.